Hey, how are you? Hi, Matt Morant. Thank you for joining us here live in Dallas, Texas, to talk about Friday Night Tykes on that fabulous new network, Esquire Network. Thanks for having me. Well, thank you so much. Tell me about Friday Night Tykes. Okay, first I've got to set the stage for you. You know, well, you may not know, uh, football is big in, in Dallas. Sure. Uh, uh, high school football, Tykes football, peewee football, you name it. Dallas Cowboys, it's really, really big here. And I'm sure we've got some overzealous parents. Uh, yeah, obviously f football is really big in the, across the country, and particularly in Texas. Um, and, you know, with youth football, uh, you know, it's a, a league and a world that parents have created for their kids to try and make their kids better players and better, better kids and, you know, and better adults when they grow older. And they definitely take it very seriously. The Texas Youth Football Association proudly boasts that they're the most competitive youth football league in America, and it is an ultra-intense, ultra-competitive environment. It is. It really is. So are we getting parents who are uh, living their dreams vicariously through their children or just want to be good parents? Which one? Well, I mean, you know, there's always some people who think my kid's going to get the scholarship and my kid is the one who's going to make it to the NFL. But for the most part, I think parents just want what every parent wants. I want what's best for my kid. Um, and that's all they really want, and that's the goal. They want to make their kid into better athletes and better, and better kids and, and better people. And I do think that's the overwhelmingly, overwhelmingly, that's the motivating factor. They want to create an environment that they think will make their kids better. The question is, you know, when youth sports, you know, that world that we created to make our kids better, is it truly beneficial for them? Or perhaps does it have, uh, you know, an opposite effect sometimes? Tell me what Friday Night Tykes is going to expose to those parents who are, um, what is that, sideline parents, or to the rest of us who are just watching. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I'm a parent. I'm a youth sport parent as well. And, you know, every, every parent has, you know, the same eternal, you know, daily struggle. You know, how far do I push my kids? How hard do I push my kids? Uh, I don't know what the answer is. You know, you want to teach your kids certain skills. You want what's best for your kid. But sometimes, you know, you know, where is that line? Because if you go too far, you're going to have your kid, uh, you know, reject the things and the skills that you're trying to teach. You know, I don't know where that line is, but, um, you know, it's important to figure out, you know, where, where we think that line might be. And down in Texas, they have a very clear definition that it's, you know, it's probably on the side of pushing our kids much, uh, much harder than maybe some other people would. Oh, yeah, that's serious. But they say in America, football is king. That's reigning across all of the states in America. So when you do Friday night, uh, well, when you do, uh, what are you calling it? Uh, Friday, Friday night, night tights. tights. Yes. Yeah. Um, uh, what, what, will we learn anything? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, sports offers great storytelling opportunities. Sports really represents sometimes the best and worst that society has to offer. Uh, you're going to see some incredibly poignant, warm moments of adults clearly making a difference in kids' lives and creating memories for them they'll cherish forever. And then you're also going to see on the flip side some horrible moments where you would be like, man, I'm just not sure we should be doing this to our kids. You're the executive producer, and you come with a pretty stellar resume. I was <laughs> reading that you produced Real Sports with Brian Gumbel and also one of my favorite World Series of Poker on ESPN. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah, no, we, uh, we started doing the World Series of Poker in 2003. And I uh, did it for eight years, yes. That is awesome. That really is. So you've got this skill that you're going to bring to uh, a smaller world, and I'm hopefully, hopefully, hopefully parents will see themselves and young people will see aspiration from what you're doing. This is the first season? Uh, this is the first season, yes. All right, then. Well, I'm going to be looking for you to be around a lot of seasons because I'm telling you, the people in Texas alone are going to support you. I'm serious. <laughs> They love football. They love good football. They love losing football, winning football. We just love football in Texas. Yeah, you tell definitely me, do. Tell me what night uh, Little Tykes, Friday night Tykes is going to come on. Friday night, probably, huh? Uh, no, it's actually on Tuesday night. At the, it's a two-hour uh -huh. premiere uh, tomorrow night on the Esquire, Esquire Network, and it's on 9 p.m. Eastern time. Well, I want to wish you the best of luck, and I'm really hoping this will be a great show for us in Texas and across the nation. Thanks Mark so much. Mark thanks so much. I appreciate you having me on. Thank you.